Mina vänner, nu ska det avgöras. This is when it will be decided. This is the dead heat. Anders Bagge som leder. Anders Bagge. Och Cornelia, and Jacobs. Cornelia Jacobs. They have both been at the top of the bookies all week, we should say. No one's been able to call it. She needs at least 46 points in order to beat Anders Bagge. 46 is the number she needs at least. Snart vet vi. Snart vet vi vem som vinner Melodifestivalen 2022. Och alltså kommer att representera Sverige Eurovision Song. Det är Anders Bagge och Cornelia Jacobs. Do you want to hear the answer out there? She needs 46 points. Come on now, Oscar. Ni där hemma har valt att ge Cornelia Jacobs. Swedish public has chosen to give Cornelia Jacobs. Seventy points. We have a winner of Melfest 2022, and her name is Cornelia Jacobs with the song "Hold Me Closer." Congratulations, Cornelia. This is the first time in a long time that we had a female act win Melfest. In fact, it's been since 2014. Wow. That is huge, and it is something she has just been putting all her love, focus, passion on. She wanted this so badly. She really did. And look at her, look at the emotion. Oh, the tears, the joy. And of course, her grandparents are here, right? Do you know that her granddad had a dream? He said, I, when he'd seen her on in Heat One, he said, you know what, he woke up one morning, had dreamt of her, said, we need to go there, we need to go to the final. And that dream was a premonition, clearly, because he's here, they're here, because she then ended up winning, right? What a good luck charm he is, fantastic. And it's pretty epic because, you know, Cornelia has been playing a band since she was in middle school. You know, this has been a long journey, and here she is, look at I can't that. believe it. Humbled by her victory. The crowd are getting up onto their feet. People wow. waving their signs, their lights, their uh, balloons, many, many balloons here in the, in the stadium tonight. Of course, she has the Swedish audience behind her, as well as the international jury, which is just so lovely. Look at that, a new name to write onto the Songbird statue there. And I thought it's pretty appropriate, this tweet from Daniel saying, let's, let's listen to uh, the audience applause there. Incredible. And as Daniel said, Sweden is truly the pop music capital of the world. Well, with this song, I think we've got a good chance of continuing to be just that. <laughs> scary <laughs> up onto the stage. <laughs> Incredible scenes here at Melody Festival in 2022. If you can't pass the commentator booth, Farah and Cornelia, you're welcome to come and say hi. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Cornelia, very welcome here. I've actually just got your spare seats. If you need a glass of water, I, I can help. <laughs> Absolutely incredible. Did you know this is actually the first time ever a winning song has more than one female songwriter? Because two out of three songwriters were female on this track. Well, there you go. And of course, you know, she has also uh, co-written uh, a song for Melfest last year. She's competed twice in a band. You know, she does have Melfest in her blood, but what's she saying here? She is saying, uh, Farah just asked, are you ready to perform this song a million more times? And Cornelia said, yes, I will sing it a million more times. She loves the song and you can really tell. She, when we spoke to her the other day, she talked about the emotion that this song holds for her and she really conveys that. I think that has definitely been part of the recipes for success here. And I can just say that Pat Anderson has just walked past, you know, the Gothenburg commentator will pass the booth here cheering us on. Oh, I'm glad his commentary went well. Now, the party is about to come to an end. But it will continue straight after this in SVT1, SVT Play and inside the Mellow app. 
Yep. Stick around for that because you actually might see some familiar faces. Indeed. Indeed. Mm. Now, Olivia, can I just say I'm just so happy. This has been an amazing show. Thank you, Farah. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you to everyone watching at home. And thank you, Olivia, for being my male first queen. I am beyond words. Thank you for this. And thank you, and tack to everyone watching in Cardiff, Glasgow, Toronto, Melbourne, LA, uh, New Zealand, uh, Vilnius in Lithuania, Germany, Indonesia. We're running out of time to even name all the countries, but we me it means so much to us. Keep the tweets coming at Melfast World. And uh, thank you to Bella Kavis, who I can only say is literally the Melfest queen. I hope to see her on stage one day soon because <laughs> this show would be nothing without, without her. So thank you uh, to her, her brilliance, and also to Peter, our sound man. Now, it is an honor to get to present the winner of Melody Festival in 22, 2022. It's Maconia Jacobs. Thank you, everyone. to apologize <laughs> Cause there's nothing to regret Well, this is not what I wanted Guess all the good things come to an end So maybe bye-bye Wish you the best But most of all I wish That I could love you less <laughs> So maybe you're right Find someone else You say it isn't me But when did that ever help? And it may have Hold me closer Although you leave Before the sun rise Might be bleeding But don't you mind I'll be fine Oh, excuse me I found the right one At the wrong time But until the sun rise Hold tight, hold tight too fast Friends I guess that I understand You say that you never felt this way for anyone And that's why it scares you to death So baby, bye bye Though it's for the best Still I can see how that would be so pain in my chest
Melodifestivalturnéns huvudsponsor